Let's start with McDonald's, an interesting reaction there. When it comes to comparable sales, growth there was just 1.9%. That was slower than analysts had been looking for. Uh, and you take a look at what the sell side is saying, that according to Citi, the stock is likely to fall under modest pressure. You had a near-term uh, miss both on EPS and EBIT as well. So you add all together, the stock is down 2.4%. It's a slightly different story if you take a look at what's going on with Coca-Cola. Like you said, they actually raised uh, their 2024 forecast. At, that's after organic revenue came in at 11% in the quarter, turning to the full year. They're now seeing as much as 9% growth. Previously, that had been uh, a range of 6 to 7%. But maybe you're not seeing too much movement in the stock. It is moving a little bit higher there. But some pressure to the downside comes from the fact that unit case volume missed estimates. And like you mentioned, Manus, Coca-Cola said that its prices have continued to climb. It actually hiked prices across a mix of its products by 13% in the quarter. So we'll see how much more pricing power they have.